All right, so now we are moving on to a subtraction equation with a fraction and a mixed number. I start by making my equal track. I circle my variable because I want to get that alone. I see here that this is a subtraction equation. So what is the inverse operation of subtraction? That is addition. So I'm going to be adding four ninths on this side. That will cancel out. So anything I do to the left side to isolate this, I have to do to the right side. So it is five and one third plus four ninths. Okay, I'm going to add this. However, I'm looking here and I see that I have one fraction that has a three as a denominator and one fraction has a nine as a denominator. I cannot add these until they are the same denominator. So I'm gonna pull these fractions out. One third plus four ninths. Okay, I have to make sure my denominators are the same. I know that three can go into nine, so I'm going to, to try and make one third an equivalent fraction to something over nine. So this is review. Three times what will give me nine? I know three times three is nine. And anything I do to the bottom, I must do to the top. So I multiply one times three. So I have three ninths. So now, instead of five and one third plus four ninths, I'm actually going to have, I'm gonna rewrite this as five and three ninths, because that's the equivalent equation, I'm sorry, equivalent, equivalent fraction to one third, five and three ninths plus four ninths. Okay, what is three plus four? That is seven. My denominator stays the same, and I add my whole numbers. Five plus nothing is five, so y equals five and seven ninths.